these things happen? They happen to you, not to me. You think I caught your luck? Well, normally I'd say no. But we just saw an Elvis potato, so I'd say anything's possible. I guess there's one way to find out, huh? Chancy here is a genuine hero. Give me three more. Three more. He single-handedly stopped this slow life, this scum, this one-celled organism of a person from coming in here, robbing and killing everyone in here. Give me another one. Okay. That's weird. Never taken more than seven. Your turn. Give the lady a ticket. Yeah. Give her five. Oh. A hundred dollars. Tag, you're it. I've never won anything in my life. You think that... I don't know. Thanks. Keep it. Don't push your luck. Chancy, uh, Chancy, uh, some of the boys, they, they want to meet you at the back. Uh, this is, come on, this is Julio. Uh, this is Tony. And this is Louie. I told you to stay out of our business. You know I told you. I didn't do nothing. Yo, yo. Come here, girl. Take care of the two boys. Yolanda? Do it. We don't got all day. No. Yolanda, no. Most people that witness gang-related crimes are understandably reluctant. What with the threat of retaliation. What are you saying to me? You don't want me to be a witness? No, that's not what I'm saying at all. Excuse us a second. I'm trying to give you a way out of this. If you want to take it. Why should I do that? A boy is dead. He's probably going to stay that way. This is real dangerous, Angie. Gangs. Something happened. I saw it. Now they want me to pretend it didn't happen. Is that what you would do? Well, I'm not going to do it either. I just want to get this over with. The girl that I saw that did the shooting, uh, her name was Ricky. She used to come into my diner a lot. She's a member of the 13th Avenue gang. Oh, yeah. We know them. Girlfriends of the bangers decided to start their own show. There's feminism for you. Why blame feminism? Why not blame drugs or unemployment or bad role models? Feminism works for me. Did you recognize anybody else? 
Nope. And you're still willing to be a witness? Yes, I am willing to be a witness. Okay. That's it then. We'll be in touch. It's me. I want this. Let's get out of here. I think you may have overthought the whole thing, Ange. Thanks again. Oh. Mm. <laughs> mm. You may think this is stupid, but I think I caught your luck. Mm. I was going to explain my whole body is vibrating at a different level of energy. It's kind of magnet for it. Mm. What do you charge yourself? Uh, Two fifty. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? You're going to make yourself crazy. Well. How was to explain the fact that I held a newborn baby in my arms and three hours later I'm witnessing the death of a young man? I mean, this is crazy. Is there any reason for it? I ask myself the same question every day and I still don't know the answer. I didn't tell the cops everything. Yeah? One of the girls in the gang, somebody I know, her name's Yolanda. Her father used to work for me. She's a smart girl. She's bright. She's sweet. I, I, she was standing there holding the gun. I couldn't believe it. And I yelled at her. So they saw you? Yeah. This is not good, Ange. I'm thinking maybe I should go talk to her father about it. I don't know what I'd say, but I think... There, there's got to be a reason why I was there. Maybe I'm just supposed to help her out or I think you're right. I don't know who you think you are to come here with these lies about my Yolanda. Hector, you know me. Why would I make something like this up? I don't want this to be any more true than you do. Mr. Morales, she risked her life to come here for your daughter. Why would she lie? Hey, man, do I know you? I don't know you. All I know is my Yolanda is home nights, studying for her SATs, not out running with some gang involved in a murder. What if you're wrong? Hector, the police know who shot that kid. They're going to arrest everybody in the car. Now, I think you need to get your daughter a good lawyer before this whole thing blows up. She no. doesn't need a lawyer! Because she had nothing to do with that boy being shot! Won't you at least talk to her? Why don't you talk to her yourself? Yolanda! Hi. What's up, Elsie? You remember, Angie? Yeah, sure, from the diner. Best friends in the world. Why? Nico, listen. She says that you're involved in some kind of shooting. Is that true? No, puppy. I'm the gang girls in this neighborhood, but I don't have anything to do with them. Yolanda, I saw you. Now tell us the truth. I don't know what you're talking about. That boy is dead. She said no! I raised four girls on my own. I work two jobs so they can go to Catholic school so they don't end up in a gang. She's a straight-A student. I believe her. Now get out of my house! But uh, I'm a casting director. Here's my card. You can see it's legit. Anyway, I've been in town for weeks looking for the right girl. Excuse me, woman. To be in a national multi-million dollar ad campaign for a new spray cleanser. Anyway, like I said, you're not going to believe this, but I think you might be the girl. Excuse me, woman. I've been looking for you. What are the chances? Better than you think. There you go. You... Don't seem surprised. Well, I'm surprised you're not Ed McMahon. I was expecting him to show up any minute now. But this could be potentially exciting, don't you think? I'll tell you what, uh, Daniel. I've got kind of a high threshold for excitement today. Sorry to disappoint you. 